Well, St. Patty's Day may be next week, but the celebrations in the upstate kick off this weekend. It's never too early for a good party, right? Irish Bar and Restaurant The Playwright is hosting their first ever Kilt Fest. Vanessa De La Vina shows you how you can get down the Irish style. This weekend, downtown Greenville is going green. The celebrations for St. Patrick's Day will be in full swing, including the first ever Kilt Fest. We'll have some outside music, face painting for the kids, uh, outside traditional Irish snacks. We'll have outside beer for everyone. The Guinness people will be here pouring fresh Guinness for us. This is the playwright's first St. Patty's Day since they opened last year, and they're going big. With food and drink specials. Our drink specials will be top-notch. Fresh Guinness, like I said. Uh, Jameson specials, you know, about the works. Whatever you would think about having at a traditional Irish pub, we'll be ringing in the St. Patrick's Day this year with it. From fresh, hot, and delicious bangers and mash to comforting and tasty chicken pot pie, you'll enjoy the luck of the Irish and your taste buds will thank you for it. Of course, you can't call it an Irish party without some authentic Irish tunes. It is the holiday of the year if you're an Irish band, of course. So uh, we get pretty amped up and we're looking forward to it. The accidentally Irish lads will fill the air with music and plenty of drinking songs. The whole party is set to take over the courtyard in front of the playwright, Rain or Shine. The party continues next Thursday on the actual holiday. We'll have more traditional Irish music uh, that night. We'll start at 5 o'clock. Uh, doors open, same drink specials, and we'll ring it in right. So throw on your best green outfit or bare those legs in a kilt for some all-out Irish fun. For Scene on 7, I'm Vanessa de la Viña. The Playwrights Kilt Fest kicks off with music, food, and drink specials this Saturday at 2 p.m. Of course, the Playwright is right behind us here in downtown Greenville near River Street.